We want to get to the other news we're covering tonight. The Jags are getting closer to putting a roof over TIAA Bankfield. Jags team president Mark Lamping spoke to Venues Now, an online sports and entertainment business publication. Now he says that the team has hired a design consultant for its stadium redesign and a roof is in the picture. So Andrew Padillo is live now in the studio. Andrew, this is something that has been on the wish list of a lot of Jags fans. It may honestly be a first. Fans I heard from on social media say they can some they sometimes can't even make it past halftime because it's been so hot at games. Extreme heat that can suck the joy out of rooting for your team, but a roof could change all of that. You think a roof is needed at TIA Bank Field? I posed a question on Twitter. Dozens of replies came in recounting brutally hot games. BCB Batman on Twitter writing about his day starting in the stands and ending on a stretcher. Another fan sent this picture. And sometimes it's all you need to tell the story. There's not a whole lot of room. You're just sweat dripping everywhere. You can feel sweat everywhere. It just feels like you like crawled into a tub and you're just dripping and there's nothing you could do to cool down. Jesse Polish is a season ticket holder and remembers one game in particular a sweltering game in September 2019. Water wasn't even staying cool enough for you to, you know, feel better. Um, and there's people passed out in the hallways, on the ramps. Um, I think somebody a few rows down from us had to be escorted out because they were passed out in their seats. The Jacksonville Fire and Rescue Department reported 86 medical calls and 18 people taken to the hospital from that game. Brutally hot game day experiences, fans dread but could soon be able to enjoy. Mayor Lenny Curry announcing the city is partnering with the Jaguars for their future stadium renovation. The Jags have stated one of their goals is to have shaded seats, an upgrade for fans and for the entire city. And if you have an upgraded stadium, everything kind of just follows it. You know, the, the better events here that kind of bring money to the stadium as well and to the city. This news, of course, coming as the Jaguars get ready for their first home primetime game in years. So fans will be able to enjoy the game under, against the Titans under the lights rather than under the sun. In the studio, Andrew Badillo, First Coast News on your side.